G'day cobbers. Today we're doing something rather different in motors. We've got a brand new Australian ute behind me to test drive and we've come to Bondi Beach to get some sun surf and a bit of fun. They tell me that uh, there's nothing really dangerous in this lake. It's a shark. Did I ever tell you they call me the Crocodile Dundee of the motoring world? Got it! Look at the size of this beast! Well, it's not every day you come to work and wrestle a shark before midday. The Malu is actually a pickup but it's probably the weirdest pickup I've ever seen. The Malu is clearly your perfect surfer's dude car in Australia. Whether or not it's great for England, I've got second thoughts. You've got this tonneau cover hard top on the top here, which means your load is strictly limited, which means it's not really a very practical pickup. The cabin's an interesting place to be. The seats are remarkably comfortable but too much of the cabin, despite the leather trim, is too low rent, particularly when you think you're paying 51 grand for this car. Australian luxury is clearly a lot different to British luxury interiors. Unlike most of the English pickups, you only get the option of two seats in this car. In truth, Practicality is not the Malou's greatest strong point because despite the macho looks, there's also no all-wheel drive. You can't go adventure tracking in this. Despite the thunderous 6.2 litre V8 under the bonnet, when you're actually driving along in a relaxed manner, it is remarkably relaxing to drive. The wheel's a bit of a sort of handful, it's like the size of a truck wheel. It really does take a bit of manoeuvring around. And the gearbox, well, let's just say it needs a very, very firm gear change there. One area that will depress you, the Malou sadly has got a bit of a drink problem. I'm getting out of it just over 21.2 to the gallon. People are fascinated by this car. It's a bit like driving a yellow submarine down the road. But there is a very large but, and that is the price. 51,500 pounds is just too much for this. That is just mad money. And it's money that I couldn't pay. 